specifically what does the tattoo on your arm? Is that for anything specific? Yeah, uh, <laughs> I, this is, um, it means 11, and it's, uh, it's my football squad number. I put it on my football boots and uh, <laughs> yeah. I mean, I wanted a tattoo for ages and I had to go through all the irrelevant people like David Barrow, the producer, and that's kind of game done, and he was like, well, no, not really. And then when I finished, he said, you know what, go do it. Um, thanks, mate. And uh, I've, been, I've been mulling over in my head for ages thinking what to get, and I thought, why not get that? It's, it's always going to be my score number, it's not going to change. Uh, I still play football, so yeah. What position do you play? Uh, well, I started off on the wing, so I got 11, and now I then moved it to, to centre forward. Are you any good? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> good enough to get a tattoo. <laughs> well, <that's good. laughs> um, do you enjoy travelling? Uh, no, not really. I'm, I'm terrified of planes. Uh, okay, yeah, thank you. <laughs> No, I'm really scared. Once I'm in the air, I'm okay. I quite like the whole turbulence thing, but it's, it's, the, it's the take off. I hate it. it don't, don't most planes crash on take off? Is that like take off? Yeah, yeah. So I, it really, really freaks me out. I don't know. What was that? Most planes do fine. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah if you were here last year, um, I'm quite clumsy, and if it's going to happen, it'll be to me. Um, we had an incident with the water. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you remember that. Um, I, I, I know it's thinking as well, because we used to, because I live in Leeds, which is about 200 miles away from where we film. And so we, had, we used to fly um, down on a, on a Sunday night and then fly back on a, on a Friday night. And this that's twice a week, and I'm thinking, well, the odds are quite high, and it's not, I'm not going to crash, but if I keep going planes twice a week, my odds are getting very, very low. And, and so I stopped doing it. I drive them. Okay, well, um, is there anywhere you would like to visit them? I've already done that, haven't I? Yeah. Yeah. Where else is there? Uh, I'd quite like to go to Egypt. Okay. Cool. Yeah. For the history of it? Just... No, yeah, no, absolutely. I, I did the history of GCC, I thought it was so fascinating. Um, you know, going back to ancient Egypt, all that kind of stuff, to you know, the pyramids and all that kind of stuff. I'd like to go on a boat down the Nile. I think it's just really cool. Okay. Um, did you. We have a fan who wants to know if you had to take dance lessons for Goblin Fire. Yes, yes we did for like uh, two, two or three months. <laughs> and uh, you know, I'm from up north in England and we don't dance up there. <laughs> and, uh, I wasn't a big fan of that. You know, I play football and play other stuff and drink. <laughs> but um, we, uh, I, I got really into it. And the, the guy came, which is about ready to dance now, and uh, it was like waltz and tango. And I was really nervous, but it was, it was really cool. <laughs> I really enjoyed it. It was something that actually I thought. When I'm done, I might look into like doing it again, because it was really cool. So I recommend it, yeah. Well, they say it makes you better at football, so... Well, I, yeah, so it didn't, didn't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, we have, how do you feel about Neville's changes in Deadly Hollows? Do you look forward to having to play the new changes on film? Yeah, definitely. Hopefully I can get rid of that fat suit. <laughs> No, I, I really, I thought it was really cool because he wasn't in it at all at the, at the start and I was thinking, where, where is he? Um, I mean, I knew he was going to be still back at school, but I didn't think he'd be doing quite that much, you know, to be the leader of the resistance, effectively, was, was mind-blowing. And, um, and so it, it, I just, I can't wait to, to get the script and read it and, um, and just see what I'm going to be doing. I, I, I want to try and focus on it so I want to really, really work harder, so I'm hoping I get the script quite early on before my scenes because it's not much, I mean, it does, it does a lot towards the end, but there's not much in terms of the whole story. So I want to really make it count. So you're excited that it's going to be two films instead of one, so they get more um, story in there? Yeah, definitely, yeah. Yeah, because there's just far too much in there to put into, into one film. You know, the years before, we've, we've lost a lot of stuff, which has been a real, real shame sometimes. And as a fan of the books myself, I've hated the stuff that's been missing. And so if they can make two films and get everything in there and do it right, then that's going to be 